my name is Oreluwa. I'm reporting live from Keep Fit Africa TV. As you can see, I'm on the street. I'm going down right now to see people's perspective on a waist trainer. Like, waist trainer, does it work? Some say it works and some say it doesn't. I can't say it works. I don't even know if it works or it doesn't. But trust me, this is going to be an educating content because you're going to be loving it. Let's go. Okay, um, basically, waist trainers or waist cinchers, as they are called, are steel bone um, things that help you to give you poise and help you to reduce your waist by a few inches. Now, like you know, a lot of Nigerian ladies are insecure about their waist. We have big tummy and everything. So when you wear it consistently for a couple of hours a day over a period of time, it helps you reduce your waist by a few inches. Do you understand? But there's been speculations that if you wear it too much maybe your womb will shift or your ribs will break or something like that but I just think uh, I just think that he helps because I use it actually I've been I used to wear it when I was in like a lot and my waist actually reduced like there was a visible difference between what my waist was and what it is now and I still use even though I don't use it as consistently as I use when I was in uni lab but there's a visible difference Different strokes for different folks I personally don't believe it works you know all my lifetime that I've worked with clients in a bit to lose up to 31.6 kilograms. No waist trainer, no pills, no other concoction, anything. It was just diet and exercise. Chicken up. Waist trainer, wow, yeah. I think I've heard about it, yeah, yeah. Have you used it before? Uh, actually, <laughs> I'm not the woman. It's, it's, it's mostly ladies that I, I hear use waist trainer, so I've never tried it. I've never even touched it. Well, what, what, I, what I've heard and what, what they say about waist trainer is it helps them to, to put their waist in shape or something. And then when they work out, they just, there's a particular shape that they want to get. So the waist trainer just helps to, you know, adjust their body to be in shape. That's what I know. I feel if you are consistent with using it, it's going to work for you. You don't just use waist trainer and then you keep, you know, doing some things you're not supposed to do in order for it to work. So in other words, it's just like working out. If you're working out, you, you have um, some regulatory, your dietaries that you're supposed to take in so that you can see the effect of your workout. So I think same goes for waist trainer. Um, if you're using waist trainer, if you want to make it consistent, especially for the ladies, then you need to watch your intake. You make it consistent to work out with it every single time. At the same time, you have a diet plan meal so that you can see the essence of the waist trainer, the effect of the waist trainer. So that's my two cents about it. Um, most of the people that I, I, I recommend waist trainer for are cinchers. And for people that have their stasis rectal, that's the separation of the abdominal muscles. Because the waist trainer helps them to push their muscles together. So I recommend waist trainer for such people. So my perspective about waist trainer, I need that one of the things that is that I don't know the physiological effects of waist trainer in losing fat. That's one thing I can't really define. If there's anybody that could define it for me, I would say, okay, good. Because when we're a waist trainer, waist trainer does not remove fat from the body. Without exercise, and without cutting down the amount of calories that you intake, I don't know how fat is going to get out of the body. So my own perspective of the physiotherapy is I feel waist trainer is just for contraction of the stomach. Do you understand? But not really that it removes fat from the body. You can't be wearing a waist trainer and you don't exercise and you eat late at night and you think it will fly off from your stomach. It's not done. Me, I feel that one of the things you need to do, you need to work out, you need to do exercise, and you need to cut down the amount of calorie intake that you're taking. Without that, I don't see how waist trainer works. De de but then, we have what we call lumbar corset. There are other things that are like co lumbar corset that people with low back pain use just to prevent excess deformity of the back, but not that this thing actually heals them. Do you understand? So why not talk about a waist trainer, putting on a waist trainer, even some people go ahead using a waist trainer to jog, they need to do abdominal exercises and all that. So for me, I don't see the effect as a physiotherapist. I don't know how the fat goes, I don't know, but maybe there's a, a better way another person can explain to me. But for me, I don't see the effect of waist trainer in losing fat. For me, I, I use it for better posture. I I would I would cinch up because it gives me that gait in I stand up tall. Well if you say she
sure, but I'm like more of the gates. I'm more of keeping your back firm. I'm more of standing up tall. People say it's effective, helps you to burn the belly fat and I know that, but personally for me, I don't subscribe to it. Um, I feel like it's not as healthy as working out generally, yeah, because it's, um, it's kind of, um, what's the word now? I feel it disturbs your breathing because, okay. yeah, it's going to, you know, compress your whatever. I don't know the right word to use, but I don't, for me personally, I don't think it's healthy to use. That's a very deep question. Reason being is, you know, we have um, different um, opinion. That's one. Some people believe that when they use waist trainer, automatically they're going to slim down. But it, I don't, I'm not of that um, opinion. You know, I stand to counter that because if you are using waist trainer and you are not watching your diet and you are not working out, it's definitely once you remove it, your tummy and everything flaps up, um, flaps out the back. And that's not um, that's not the essence of using waist trainer. Yeah, using waist trainer not just even because of that. I think it also controls your rib. Some people that have back issues, after birth um, pains and all that, I think it works for that as well. So that is the major reason why I use it. I use it because of after, after childbirth pain, that back, you know, pain. So that's the major reason why I use it. It helps you restrict. Most of them wear it out in a day. It restricts what you eat. Okay. When you eat, you know that you are, you are actually tight. You can't take more than what you eat. And it helps. Fashion, right? Yeah, the fashion. And some of them help you. Wear, they call them sweat belts. Some of them are sweat belts, not that weight trainers. Sweat belts help you to burn up the fat in your tummy. That's what it does. And costing sense, it makes it better. It keeps you fit. Well, I also think it depends on the person using the waist trainer. You don't put on a waist trainer then decide not to work out or decide not to exercise or decide not to jog. As a matter of fact, if you really want the effect or the, or the result of a waist trainer, you still need to work out. Because without working out, you can't have a flat tummy. Because that's the idea, to have a flat tummy, to have a perfect shape and all that. You still need to work out to burn the fats. The waist trainer cannot completely burn the fat. So you need to work out, you need to do exercise, more of exercise to burn the fat. Then you will see the effect of the waist trainer on you. So without workout, it might not necessarily work. It might just put, you might just put on a dress. Some people put it on underneath the dresses. You can put on your dress, then put on the waist trainer, then just to have a good shape. But the, if you really want to see results, you have to work out to the waist trainer too. I meet some people and they say it has been, it has snatched their waist, it has done this. So I think it works for some people. It works for them. I really don't, for me, I don't encourage my clients or anybody I know to use the waist trainer because of its um, hazard to the system. You know, when you're squeezing that stuff, you can imagine that you're squeezing so many things inside your body. Do you understand? Your kidney, your organs, and all that stuff. Is still I think that what I've heard about it, you know, from internet, it looks like it works for people. But from personal experiences of people, it's not as, um, you know, the, the results are not as are not as effective. Yeah, I've just had a lot of people say how um, inconvenient it is and, you know, how long it takes them to, act to see actual results. So I think it's mixed. I've just never tried it. It's not my thing at all. The waist trainer, my yeah. perspective is it creates that unique personal attention to yourself to be able to hold firm your abs. Don't forget, once you put it up, okay. it holds you firm, right? Yes. Now, people neglect themselves in such a way that they just walk and let go, bad posture, okay. and their tummy just bulges out, or too much gas. So, putting it on, the first thing is, ah, oh, I'm tucked. <laughs> you can't, so you're always in that consciousness, right? So it helps them to, don't forget why we're even working out, I tell them, talk in those abs while you're doing those exercises to get the muscles involved. So I can say the help it will do while exercising might be that consciousness if you always let go easily, but it always, at least, okay, holds firm. Um, don't forget, exercise goes with nutrition. Okay. So if you are just putting it on and you are not disciplined enough to really take care of your nutrition, you might not see that. So it gives you that. It, gives, it, it just gives you that aesthetics look. When you're going for an event and all that, 
Yeah, yeah. But yes, you can just put it on and just do anyhow. Do anyhow, you see anyhow. You understand? But put in those basic things you need to put into place. Your exercise, your nutrition, tummy top, it goes faster. Oh, okay. I use it too. I have it. It's really nice. It depends on the one you are getting to. Because they have um, steels, like number of their steels and all. So I think it's good for working out. Like, you see the changes by your waist, your tummy and all that. So it's very nice. It's good. So the waist trainer theory is ambidextrous because there are different schools of thought. So now the first one is, people would say that, oh, the waist trainer will help um, shrink your internal organs. But the truth about it is when a lady is pregnant, her internal organs go different ways because of the baby in her stomach. So what I would say is, to everything you do, there's always caution. So you need to know how to use the waist trainer. Because the truth is, um, if you tie your hand, it becomes smaller because of the stress you've placed on it. So the body will always adapt to whatever stress you place on it. So I think it's not totally bad. It depends on how much education you have on how to use it. That's why I feel. Um, for me, I'm not really okay with the waist trainer. I'd rather you should do the exercise because waist trainer most times gives you some deform, like it's, it's not going to be rhyme if instead of using the um, exercise, doing the exercise. So I prefer exercise for you to work out. I'm not saying it works because it's just a perspective. Just the, the something will just work on your mind. Not that it's something is real. I don't know if it's working for them, but for me, I am not a, a part of it. Yeah. Waist trainer, I would say it's not, it's not, does not work for everybody. But I believe that when you, when you are with that, and wearing that waist trainer, you have to also work out. You cannot just wear it and does it for fashion. It's not for fashion. If you want to get that desired body, you have to also work out with it to get that desired shape you want. Oh, no, really. Why would I say so? Because if you just wear it, basically, I just want to wear it without doing anything. It's just like you Let's say you're going on. to school and then you don't want to learn. You're just going to school, but going to say, you have to use it to do your workout. You're going to use it to do your workout. So what are you using it to do your workout? Um, some people say it doesn't work, but for me, using a waist trainer, when you want to use a waist trainer, you make sure you have some aerobic session, cardiovascular, you move your body. So you will get more results when you, while using a waist trainer, you work out. So you get more results than just using it. And again, using a waist trainer without watching your diet is useless. So you must make sure you watch whatever you eat so that it will help your belly fat. So as the waist trainer is working on the outer part of your abdomen, we need to, working out to help, will help it. After going for days, weeks, to ask people's perspective about this waist trainer or the thing, like seriously, it's so educative because I myself don't even know if it works or it doesn't. So what's your own perspective? What can you tell me about this waist trainer or the thing? I'm still on it because I'm pushing this content out to you guys there. I want you to give me your own feedback. I want to see from your own perspective. I want to know what you think, what you feel about waist trainer. Some says it works, some says it doesn't. So watch your own perspective. Don't forget to click on the notification button, like, subscribe to our YouTube channel, share with family and friends, let them comment on that it. Comment as well. Let me hear from you. Let me see from your own perspective. Does it work for you? What do you think about waist trainer? Please share your own with us. Thank you very much.